hi guys welcome back to my channel welcome back to my hood and today we're gonna be doing a pregnancy update video and i guess i'm gonna just like answer random questions and like talk about what i've been going through and how i've been feeling i'm gonna share some ultrasound pictures and all that good stuff and i'm just gonna warn y'all i'm already out of breath so I'm gonna be out of breath throughout this whole video because we is pregnant. Okay? Okay. So, uh, I think I'm gonna just start with saying how many weeks I am. And today is Sunday, so I'm exactly 27. I'm exactly 27 weeks. Um, I keep track of it by this um, app called pregnancy plus and see it has a little baby and stuff um the ring light is messing it up but it says good evening nia and it says aj because that's my son's name well that's going to be his nickname he's going to be a junior but i'm not going to say his real name on here because that's also my boyfriend's name and we have crazy people out there i'm just saying well crazy person and i'm not playing with you so um Oh, so we're in the third trimester now, I guess. Um, this is the first week of my third trimester. And like I said, I'm 27 weeks, which is day 189. So I've been pregnant for 189 days. And like with this app, this is not sponsored. I don't get paid for this. So I'm helping you. This app, um, it shows like a real life thing of your baby and you could like interact with it, spin it around and stuff. Sometimes you tap it and it moves. Aw, isn't that cute? Okay, and it shows you like information and stuff that you need to know, whatever. So approximately, my baby is around 14.8, 14.80 inches and, um, around 2.22 pounds so about two pounds and around almost 15 inches he's growing you guys babies grow so fast it literally amazes me how fast we could create a human it doesn't even it's less than a year and that just like that baffles my mind see it has little things down here and it says right now it says um blinking mostly your baby's mostly sleeping but eyes can now partially open and the tiny eyelids are able to blink and then um, your baby recognizes different levels of light inside the womb and your baby is getting chubbier and fat is depositing under the wrinkled skin I want my baby to be fluffy I want my baby to be like the tire blow up dude I want rolls, okay? But if he doesn't come out with rolls, that's okay, obviously. But I don't know. I just like the idea of a chunky baby. Um, now, I guess I'm about to answer some questions. Um, I'm going to start with YouTube questions. There's not that many. There's probably like one YouTube question that I posted on like some of my other videos. Somebody commented. Um, number one, y'all told me to keep you updated. So here's an update. Number two, someone was like, um, you don't look happy to be pregnant. Well, the last time when I filmed that video, not the, um, it was my announcement that I was pregnant. That video, um, someone was like, you're not happy. You don't look happy. And I was like, well, y'all, I have morning sickness. Like, I went from never throwing up, like, not throwing up in years. Even if I'm drunk, it doesn't matter. I do not throw up. I don't do that okay but when i was pregnant i was throwing up everything uh, if i smelled something i didn't like i threw up um if i ate something i didn't like which i barely ate i threw up um i would go for, like three days without eating you just feel nauseous everything stinks like it's just you feel weak it is horrible um and all those people that are like oh my gosh i'm pregnant and they're so happy in their baby pictures or whatnot they're lying Okay, they're lying. Well, with me, it's not like that with me. Them people must be them like those girls that got their period for like two, three days. That's them. Lucky you. Hooray. I was the full blown six, seven days cramps. Some girls don't get cramps. 
I was the, I was the whole thing, the whole shebang, okay? Um, so yeah, another one was, will you teach your baby witchcraft? Yes, I am. Um, I'm not going to force him to do it. If he doesn't want to do it, then that's fine. But I want to be able to give him the knowledge of it if he ever decides that he wants to do it or if he needs it or something like that. I'm not going to force him to do um, witchcraft or whatever. And if I have kids down the line, it's the same thing for them. And I'm also not going to force them to go to church or any of that, whatever. Whatever they decide is whatever they decide, that is them. But I will try to be as informative as possible. I guess we're gonna get to the, to the question. So here's a couple questions. It says, how many months pregnant are you? I think I'm around six. I don't know. Pregnancy goes by weeks now. I don't know if it always has, but everybody's like, oh, how many months are you? I don't know. But I'm 27 weeks, so y'all could do that math or you could Google it. I'm not going to do that. But I'm 27 weeks. I think it's around six months, maybe seven. I don't know. Um, how did your family react to the news? Oh my gosh. Okay. So obviously the first person who I told was my boyfriend. Um, and then I told either my best friend first or my sister first or my sister then my best friend. Because they're like that close to me. Um then my family okay so I went home like I didn't live there anymore so I went back to my house and we were all sitting down all this like debate stuff was going on vote for whatever vote for whatever and we were all watching the news and every I was trying to get everybody together my sister didn't want me to tell my dad without her being there and she wasn't there at the time so I was like hurry up hurry up texting her and then my stepmom went in the room and I'm just like yeah when you're done can you come out and like I texted her that and then um I remember on tv um it was a commercial and I was like so y'all are gonna be grandparents and that's how I did it and nobody said anything and then stepmom she paused the tv and then she was like wait did you say we're gonna be grandparents and I was like yep and I was so scared to tell my dad like I was so scared to tell my dad and but like what I told him he like looked at me like and then he kind of smiled like half smiled and then he walked away like into the kitchen which is close to the living room and he was like we were just, me and your grandma were just talking about this, how I was, felt like I was going to be a grandfather right before his birthday. And his birthday is in March, which is actually a month before my baby's supposed to come. He was like, I knew it was going to be a grandfather before March, blah, 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 blah. And then they were just like, yeah, we support you. Congratulations. You'll be a good mom. All that other good stuff. And so they took it pretty good. I was actually shocked that my dad took it like that. Like, I thought he was not going to talk to me for at least like a week or two. But it was fine. That's how he reacted. And I was like, wow, that's cool. Do you know the sex of the baby? Oh, yeah. I don't think I've told y'all. But I did a whole gender reveal thing. And it is on my Instagram. Um, you guys can follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Snapchat. All of it is at the end of this video. At the end screen video thing with the music. It's over there. Um, it's a boy. He's a boy. That's what I wanted. I was so happy. I do want a girl eventually. But I just knew that he was going to be a boy. I knew it way before I was even pregnant. I used to have dreams about it. Um, about him being a boy. I just knew it. I knew it. Um, do you want more children? Yes, I want at least two. No more than three. If I get four, I'm getting my tubes tied. Uh, just kidding. I don't know though. But like max, max is three. If I have four, then I'm just like wasn't supposed to happen but of course I'm gonna keep her or him or whatever but I would like to have two at least what's been your biggest craving to be honest I know what I don't want and sometimes I know what I do want and sometimes I don't um, there's nothing that I really crave I have been eating a lot of more sweet stuff usually like I'm the healthier eater in my family but I have not been healthy eating um, I Yesterday I ate 
three ice cream sandwiches that I feel like that's what I crave is ice cream sandwiches um, and I craved a burger like like a fat fat juicy double patty burger and when I got that I was so happy like the grease was dripping down that's what I wanted and I was so happy um, what's the best part about being pregnant um, to be honest, I feel like everybody treats you better. They treat you better than you would um, if you weren't pregnant. And like how fast your baby grows. And I think that's like so crazy. Like I'm growing a full blown human. Like I'm gonna be somebody's mother. Like bitch, I'm a mother. No drama. Okay, so that is how, that's like the best part of being pregnant. People feed you. Mm -hmm. If you like to eat like me, people feed you, and I love that. What's the worst about part about being pregnant? My feet are swollen, and they didn't look swollen to me. But then I put on my shoes, like my tennis shoes, because I wear slides for a living. Then I had to actually go go somewhere, and I put on my shoes, and they were tight. I've been wearing a nine and a half since high school and your feet stopped growing probably since middle school to be honest and your feet girls feet stopped growing like girls stopped growing at like 18 or whatever um my shoes are tight my back hurts a lot a lot um physical pain like back aches your feet be hurting your stomach be hurting you be out of breath um things like that you know do you have any names picked out i already told you my son was named his name is aj um who will be with you during labor okay since it's corona time i can only bring one person so that will be my baby daddy of course my boyfriend um Um, do you have a birth plan? No. No. Natural or medicated birth? Okay, so I want to do a natural birth at the hospital. I'm going to try. And if I feel like I cannot handle it, I'm going to ask them to shoot me up. That's it. Um, are you scared of labor? Not really. Um, I don't know why. My sister is, but I'm not. I'm just, you know... What do you look most forward to after pregnancy? I don't know, just being with my baby. Being with my baby, drinking. Like, you can't have no alcohol and stuff. Like, I want I see all these pretty drinks and I just wanna, I wanna taste it at least, you know, and I can't do that. So that, that, the, the, you're drinking your bad mom. Long as you don't drink an excessive amount and don't let it take over your life, you can do whatever you want, okay? hurting nobody so yes drinking um will you breastfeed i'm gonna try to breastfeed um i really want to it's very beneficial for your baby and i heard your weight drop off you like that so i'm gonna try to do that um do you plan to work or be a stay-at-home mom i wish i could be a stay-at-home mom right now i am still working and it's january my baby's coming in april so january february march april i got three more months left and so i'm still working and after i pop him out and i heal i'm going back to work so yeah but not this job i'm getting another job okay will you make your own food for your baby um probably not but i'm not opposed to the idea like i have looked up videos of like how to make um formula for your baby and food and stuff like that and i want to try it do you have any nursery idea slash themes no i don't my baby's not gonna have his own room right now because we're in the process of trying to move and all we need is a one bedroom apartment like i don't need all that so no but he will be very spoiled i know so that's really all the questions that i 
Um, I'm gonna show y'all my baby bump, and then I'm gonna show y'all the ultrasound pictures, and then we'll be done, okay? So. Oh, also, bending down is really hard. This is my, my baby bump. Can y'all see that? This is what he looks like. He is getting big. I am obviously round. You see? Yep. Um, I had these stretch marks before I was pregnant. So they'll be like, oh, stretch marks. No, I had it. Um, this line has appeared. I forgot what it's called. But it's here in these two slits right here. They're where my piercings were. I still have them, though. And I noticed my belly button is poking out. But it, it, it pokes out now. I had it any. Oh, and also, I do have to pee every, like, 10, 15 minutes. Not even lying. Not even lying. Oh, and twice I sneezed and I peed on myself a little. I was like, oh no, ma'am, what is going on? But I guess pregnancy things, I don't sleep that much or it takes a long time for me to sleep. Um, I sleep in the daytime a lot. Unless I'm at work, then I don't. But yeah. Okay, ultrasound pictures. This is the one when I was five weeks and I called him Tadpole for the longest. So, see that dot? That's him. That was, that was my baby, the dot. I called him Tadpole forever. That was five weeks. This is nine weeks. So, this is just like five, four more weeks after. Look how fast they grow. Can y'all see that? Like, I know it's kind of blurry. And then, um, here's him again. And this is right here. That's his heartbeat. And so, the next time I went to the doctor, I heard his heartbeat. And not gonna lie, I kind of teared up a little. I was like, no, we're not doing that. Um, this is some more nine-week photos. Because he was moving. Like, he's a very active baby. Every time I go to get an ultrasound or whatever, he is always moving and having fun and stuff and i'm just like can you chill just a little bit but i am a very deep, deep, deep person you know okay and this is my i was 11 weeks and six days so the next day i would have been 12 weeks with this one that i'm about to show you and after that i um i have more pictures on my phone that i'm gonna show y'all i actually have two videos too they're really short um, and after those, I haven't seen him. Like, I haven't been to an ultrasound. I've been to the doctor, but I guess it's because, like, I have Medicaid or Medicare or whatever, and so they're just like, eat. No. All right, this is 11, week, 11 weeks and six days. He's way bigger, and he's chilling in there, big-headed ass baby, just like me. And, yeah, that's him. Um, well, my phone is dirty. Okay, so that's a picture. And that was just his head. That's his penis. That's his head again. And that's him. And if you can see it, like you can see his lip and like his um, arm and stuff. He's laying like this. It's so cute. This was October 27th that I got these, so in October, July, August, September, October. So I was like three or four months, which was really cute. Um, here's a video of him moving. He opens his mouth. During this ultrasound, he was like sucking his fingers, putting his fingers in his mouth and stuff. Um, here's another picture, uh, another video of him opening his mouth. Like see his tongue and stuff he's really cute in this picture i think he looks like an angel like his eyes and his nose and stuff i don't know he just looks like a very cute baby um yeah those were that and then these are the most recent ultrasound pictures i have again i don't know um how many weeks i was this was in november and it's january now but this is him you can see more facial features of him 
That's his nose and his mouth and stuff. Um, nose and mouth. They're all pretty close. And then, like, his hand is in here. Um, yeah, that's it. So, that's all I have for this video. I hope y'all enjoyed it. My pregnancy update. He's growing fast, you guys. And, like, I have some more stuff to get together. And I, apparently it's called nesting. But I want, like, everything done, like, right now. Right meow for him. But I know I have to have patience and, like, things take time. But, I don't know. I just want things done. And I have stuff to do he gets here oh, okay i hope y'all enjoyed this video um like subscribe comment tell me what y'all think um all that good stuff okay and also for all the people under my other videos who are like congratulations blah blah, blah thank you like thank you guys like that was so sweet of you guys a lot of y'all commented and was like congratulations congratulations and a lot of them are witches and i'm like i'm glad that y'all support me because some people are like young mom yeah I don't care I'm 21 I'm old enough to have a child so thank you <laughs>